In regions marked by the ongoing conflict in Myanmar, recent events highlight the impact on local communities. With religious buildings reportedly damaged in the fighting and an airstrike attack in Mogo Township standing out amid the chaos. Fighting and airstrike claims at SAC outpost in Mogo Township, Mandalay region. Dang National Liberation Army, or TNLA, and allied forces reportedly attacked the Myanmar military's outpost in Kya Pien Ya Ma village in Mogo Township on June 25th and have since occupied the area. Religious buildings in Da Nang Ki Mountain were allegedly damaged. Twenty-three bodies were reportedly found on the roads in Kwa Khmer. A charity group reportedly buried 23 bodies found on the streets in Kwak Mei following intense fighting on June 27th. A family of six allegedly killed in an attack in Lashio, northern Shan State. In the early morning on July 3rd, a house in Thaya Street of Ward No. 1 in Lashio Township was reportedly struck by an artillery attack. A family of six was allegedly killed in the attack. Myanmar witnessed geolocated the damaged house using Google Earth. Airstrike attack in Kwakame Township, Shan State. At least 15 residential houses in Kwak Mei Township were reportedly damaged in an airstrike attack on June 30th. The alleged airstrike was reportedly carried out by the Myanmar Air Force. Myanmar witness geolocated the footage of the damaged buildings using Google Earth. The aftermath of fighting in Matupi Town, Chin State. Residential and religious buildings were reportedly bombed between June 9th to the 29th. Myanmar witness investigators were able to geolocate the footage of damaged houses across Matupi town. These are just a few of the many disturbing reports coming out of Myanmar. At Myanmar Witness, we collect evidence of human rights abuses in the country to hold those responsible accountable. If you have any information related to these or other human rights abuses in Myanmar, please share it in the comments below or upload the evidence securely via our website.